in these Knowledge November sessions, we've been focusing very much on directors. Let's not forget that there are shareholders or the owners of the business that perhaps sit behind the company's face that we see. Um, they do ultimately have the right to have a vote of no confidence in a director and decide that they no longer wish for them to be appointed within the organisation. So at company law, they would have to um, call a special meeting, they would have to notify the particular director concerned that they were proposing to remove them and that individual would then have the right to attend that meeting and either make written representations as to why they should remain or perhaps make those representations at the meeting. Um, those shareholders then have the opportunity to vote and if they do pass what's called an ordinary resolution, uh, then the director might find themselves, if you like, voted out. Um, that obviously is dealt with the company law angle, uh, but from an employment law pers perspective, the company is still going to have to then address that person's uh, employment. Um, typically, this might be triggering notice then under their service agreement, perhaps putting them on guard and leave for the remainder of that notice period, or um, following the usual channels that you'll be familiar with around um, putting a settlement agreement in place. The companies are going to have to think about not only the contractual position, however, they're going to have to think about um, protecting themselves from unfair dismissal claims if that person's got more than two years service um, and make sure that from uh, the perspective of ending the employment, proper processes are followed. So if, for example, um, the argument will be that um, the employment can't continue any longer because of that shareholder's uh, resolution then it may well be that we're in some of the substantial reason territory if we're not in uh, a misconduct or poor performance territory. But uh, the company will still have to follow a, a procedure to bring their employment to an end.